Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I've got something a little different for you. It's a story about love, but not the kind you see in movies. It's about real, everyday love. The kind that sneaks up on you when you least expect it. So grab your favorite drink, get cozy and let me take you on a little journey. It was a regular Wednesday evening. I was at our local cafe, the one with the mismatched furniture and the best caramel latte in town. You know, the kind of place where you can lose track of time just watching the world go by. That's when it happened. As I sat there laughing over a trivial joke, I caught myself looking at them in a way that wasn't just friendly. It was more than that, and it hit me out of nowhere. I started noticing the little things, the way their eyes crinkle when they smile, how passionate they get about their hobbies, even the way they argue with the barista about the perfect coffee temperature. These things made my day brighter, made me feel alive. But it wasn't just butterflies and rainbows. I was scared. What if they didn't feel the same? What if this confession ruined everything? So, I decided to take the leap. One evening, as we walked through the park, the city lights reflecting in their eyes, I just blurted it out. I love you. Just like that. No dramatic background music, no perfect timing, just raw, honest emotion. And you know what? They smiled. That smile that had unknowingly become my favorite thing in the world. They felt the same. It was the most ordinary yet extraordinary moment of my life. So why am I sharing this? Because sometimes love isn't about grand gestures or movie-like scenarios. It's in the small, everyday moments. And if you feel it, don't hold back. Life's too short for what-ifs. Have you ever had a confession moment like this? Share your stories in the comments below. I'd love to hear them. And if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more. Remember, love is out there, often in the most unexpected places. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.